How to get affordable online training. Steve Hansen here, co-founder of the janitorialstore.com and myhousecleaningbiz.com. Well, you know, many of us as uh, cleaning business owners, we uh, are always looking for uh, better ways to train our employees and our managers. You know, so one of the ways that we can do that is that we can go online and we can uh, do online training such as videos. Now, you may find a lot of resources that will have this available. You know, you may uh, stumble across a, a podcast that, uh, that has some kind of uh, uh, interviewing or training that way. Uh, you may come across where you can look on YouTube, uh, which will have a wide variety of uh, topics and things. But, you know, with a, a lot of these, you have to keep in mind the quality of the, the training that's, that's going on and the information that's being given. You know, uh, is it uh, is it good information? Is it viable information that your uh, that your team understands and will be able to use in the field when the time comes? So, uh, you know, and sometimes too, you know, people are training and it will be pay, uh, based on theory, not on fact. You know, and uh, that happens because maybe the lack of experience uh, of the uh, of actually providing the training themselves. But anyway. You have a lot of choices out there for your for your online training, you know, and the pricing will go. It's all over the board. It, it's just all over the board. Um, you know, I've seen things where you can buy uh, uh, DVDs for you know a hundred and some odd dollars. Uh, you can uh, you know get them on various topics. You know, hard floors. Uh, you know, just regular janitorial uh, cleaning, custodial cleaning. Uh, window washing, uh, you know, carpet cleaning, those types of things. Um, you know, and the problem with the, uh, some of the DVDs now is that most of your computers are not uh, uh, are not putting in uh, DVD players, and the ones that do, uh, there's software that's not going to support it. So that means that you have to go and you have to get a, a you know another software to help run the DVD to play the DVD, and that's really kind of a hassle. So, you know, uh, what we've done, you know, at the janitorial store in my house cleaning biz is that, you know, we created our LMS years ago and, uh, you know, it's for streaming videos online. So, you know, as long as you can get online, you'll be able to, you know, watch these training videos at, at any location that you're at, you know, anywhere in the world. Um, so, and we've seen that uh, that kind of trend, uh, everybody else jumped on the bandwagon and started develop, developing LMS, learning management systems. Uh, you know to train employees and you know you'll you'll find uh, you know quite a few of those too but you know the, the my advice would be that uh, you know look for the topics that you're wanting to train your employees on now you should be training on uh, general cleaning is, is right at the top of the list you should be teaching on uh, uh, you know the chemistry of cleaning that you know they have to know how to use chemicals and what chemicals are and how they react and things like that very important but we see that a lot of companies don't offer that training uh, something else that you need to train on uh, is a MOS is uh, safety training uh, you uh, you have to offer that safety training and uh, it's a good idea to do that annually and you're going to document everything so that's the really nice thing about uh, finding an online uh, uh, affordable online training is that you can uh, print off certificates of completion. Uh, people will have to take exams, and uh, you know ours. We set ours to where a person has to complete 80, get 80 percent correct in order to pass the exam and move on to the next in, to the next uh, video uh, in the series. And uh, we feel that that's a you know a, a pretty good a pretty good rate. Um, but those are the things that you want. You want to make sure that you get that you got documentation that the person is able to watch the video at any time. Uh, you know, uh, in either case, you're probably going to have to pay them for for doing the training, which isn't a big deal. Uh, that's a, you should be doing that anyway. Um, so you know, some of the other topics that you may want to think about are you know business skills. Um, I talk to an awful lot of cleaning companies. And um, it's, it's interesting how many uh, don't have business skills. They don't have skills in other areas such as HR, uh, leadership and management, uh, sales. Uh, you know, sales and marketing are probably the two biggest topics that, uh, that uh, a lot of people are lacking in as far as knowledge. And, uh, you know, that's where the, the affordable online training will come in handy. 
you know, you can learn what you need to know, uh, how to how to do sales and marketing and so on and so forth. You know, it's all learnable, and, and like I say, it's all online now. So, um, so when you start thinking about, uh, you know, start thinking about your budget, look at what the actual cost is for you to, uh, you know, to view the, to, you know, to be a member of of a podcast or or uh, you know whatever type of service that is that's offering the training. Uh, break it down. You got you should know what that's costing you per employee, uh, per day, and so on and so forth. So, for example, you know at the janitorial store, when you join as a premium member, you have access to Clean Smart University and CSU Business Library. And what that's costing you is it costing you a dollar seventy-seven per day. That's pretty inexpensive. Um, you know that's a, uh, pretty inexpensive. You know it's uh, it's probably two cups of coffee uh, at today's rates, but you know, uh, and in fact, you know, with that price, you actually can add five additional users. So that means that six people, you know, six people can um, have access to that for a uh, dollar seventy-seven per day. And so when you actually you, you break that down with the six users, that actually ends up being pretty pretty cheap. Um, you know, and like I say, the, the the access that they'll have is to you know all these uh, janitorial cleaning videos, you know, stripping and waxing, uh, uh, customer service. They'll have um, safety training, you know, uh, bloodborne pathogens, and many more. So you know, just make sure that you 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 find a, a good source, uh, and the uh, the videos are are quality videos. Um, you know, we always offer, uh, I always offer to do, um, to do Zoom calls and give people a tour and I can show them uh, the videos, the training videos that we have and give them an idea of what they're getting for their money. So, you know, uh, we do that, uh, you know, all the time. So whenever possible, always try to see if you can get, uh, you know, a, a preview of some sort you know, to where the person's going to actually show you around the site and how to use it and, and uh, how to train people and uh, an example of the training uh, videos. Um, you know, if you can't get that, then well, boy, it's, it's kind of hard for you to make up your decision uh, if you want to use that those training videos if you really can't, uh, you know, can't uh, get a preview of some sort. So uh, that's very important. But, uh, you know, the other thing you got to think about is uh, are you wanting to automate your training program? Um, so, meaning that, that you, as you hire people and you onboard them, uh, you may do some initial training, but then if you want uh, any additional training, you may send them to, uh, to a site to, to just uh, do the training on their own. So that's all automated. So the person would actually have a login and a password, and they would go to the site, they would, they'd watch the, watch the video, they'd probably do an exam, and, and then if they complete the exam, they'd get a certificate of completion. So, you know, which is really great because now they can, they can print that off, they can actually send you, uh, you know, the manager or the owner of the business a copy of that if they've actually completed it. Uh, and or, you know, maybe you're thinking about doing group training. So, you know, and uh, on the janitorial store what we have is uh, I've actually got training documents. So for a trainer to, uh, they have a complete uh, outline uh, of how to train groups. Uh, you know, you'll be bringing the video up on the screen and you'll be uh, inter doing introductions and breaking and pausing and different things like that. So I've got that all laid out for people. And we also have it to where it's designed for multiple types of classrooms. So a person can uh, train, you know, groups of people. It could be three people, it could be 50 people. Uh, it really wouldn't matter. And uh, we also have a system for, you know, when you want to do the exam uh, where you uh, can give everybody the exam. Uh, it doesn't matter if it would be, like I say, three people or 50 people. Uh, everybody can do the exam at, at the same time. So, you know, keep that in mind. Uh, some of the other things that you may want to look for is, for your on, uh, affordable online training, is uh, watch for PDF documents or guides. Uh, we have a lot of these uh, for our videos and uh, the guides are just a wealth of information. They, they provide additional tips and so on and so forth you know, about the video. So keep that in mind. Um, but anyway, when you're looking to get affordable online training, you know, sure, price is important, but then the other thing that we have to have, we have to have quality. So always check for those two things. 
first thing always people are going to look for is the price. Was it, was it going to cost them per user, per day, so on and so forth. And then, you know, look at the quality of, of the product. And uh, if you can, try to get a, a preview. Uh, you know, like I say, we do that at the janitorial store. Uh, I do that quite often. I'll just do a Zoom call with a person and I'll show them through the site and, and we'll uh, show them the videos, how everything works. And from there they can decide uh, uh, what, uh, uh, what action they want to take. So anyway, um, you know, that's, uh, that's about all i got on this subject. You know, uh, how to get affordable online training. And, uh, you know, I hope that you got some tips from this so you can make the right decision. Um, you know, so you're not just wasting your money on, on uh, training that's really not providing you what you need. Um, because after all, that's what it's all about. You know, we've got to make sure that we're, we're providing good training uh, to our employees and management. Oh, let me add this. Uh, another thing that I've often noticed is that, sure, you, can, you, you look around and you can find uh, training videos for frontline cleaners. They're all over the place. Like I say, and then there's different quality and so on and so forth. But, you know, the real problem is that uh, try to find some management videos, such as supervisors and management managers, you know, operations managers. You, you just can't find anything on leadership. Come to the janitorial store and we've got, we've got a wealth uh, of leadership and management videos uh, that will really, really uh, help you in the transition if you're, if you're promoting somebody into a, a supervisor position or a manager's position. So anyway, uh, that's all I got. I uh, hope you liked the video. If you did, go ahead and click uh, the like and share button. And as always, if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel, please subscribe. We've got hundreds of videos on how to build a successful cleaning company. So until next time, we'll see ya.